now. I know what time it is now. It's... Hey, what's up, guys? This is Weezak7 of Weezak Games, which you are currently watching. This video is a bit of an introduction to my channel, what I do here, a little info about me, and an opportunity for feedback from anyone who may have found the channel. This really should have went up before my Super Mario Brothers video started, but due to a mistake on my part, I lost the original intro video, so... It, excuse me, it did not. <laughs> Weezak Games is my Let's Just Play channel here on YouTube. For those of you unfamiliar with the concept, a Let's Just Play, or LP, channel is a recording of someone playing a video game, usually with commentary reviews to go along with it. I don't really plan on reviewing any games, except maybe to touch on a few things I liked or disliked about at the end of the series, when the game completes, but I will be narrating, commenting, and whatnot as I play. I record the audio at the same time as the video and don't do a lot of editing, so you can hear my natural, unrehearsed dialogue, for better or worse, as well as that of any of my friends, whom I hope to include in some of my videos in the future. Um, as a bit of a warning with the unrehearsed dialogue, I try to censor myself to a certain extent, but I don't really put forth a whole lot of effort doing that, so you may not want to watch my videos in places that are really strict about swearing, because I tend to swear when I get angry. Um, also, this video is an exception to my unrehearsed dialogue, because I plan to make this video um, efficient and concise in saying what I want to say, so I rehearsed it a bit beforehand. Victory. Uh, currently, I am uploading videos of my playthrough of the SNES remake of Super Mario Bros. 3, as I mentioned earlier. I essentially played through the entire game in one night and the following morning, so I didn't give myself a chance to learn from the audience as I went. Um, to that end, I have stopped playing the game at the beginning of World 8 until the videos catch up more. Um, and then I will finish it then. Hopefully I have a chance to get some feedback from you guys before that happens. But, we'll see. I also plan to record some Team Fortress 2 and Minecraft videos once I resolve some issues my computer has with them. I may sprinkle some World of Warcraft videos on here, though I don't intend to bore you with normal solo questing videos. I'll probably only post one of maybe four kinds of videos. PvP, um, videos, battlegrounds and whatnot. Uh, dungeon videos of, you know, raids and such like that or videos I record with friends if I find the conversation to be amusing, and I may also toss in some random montages of whatever if I feel so inclined. Um, obviously some of those may overlap with each other. Uh, I've considered recording our regular D&D &D sessions um, with my group and I as we use a virtual tabletop to play since we're scattered throughout the Midwest. Um, and finally, I may do a few videos here and there as sort of a rant videos, just talking about video games in general and my opinions on certain things. Um, those may double up with other videos, though, so I'm not sure. But Ego Raptor's comparison between Castlevania 1 and 2 is a good example of what I mean, and there's a link in the description. I will not be animating it, because unlike Ego Raptor, I, am not, I do not have animation skills, so I'll have to find some other visual medium to supply you with while I do that. Um, if any of these, uh, these ideas seem appealing to you, I would recommend that you watch them, give the channel a subscribe, a subscribe, and watch out for those videos. And if any of them seem unappealing to you, I would recommend that you avoid watching them. Because it will be my goal here to have a variety of things, so that a wide range of people will be able to find something they enjoy watching. Nicely played, sir! Team Fortress or other FPSs for those people who enjoy that, some World of Warcraft videos for people who like that, Minecraft videos, um, old school console games, etc. Um, things that do really well I'll record more often, and things that do poorly I'll record less frequently or just fade out entirely. I think you're doing some damage. Two plus two is. In base four, I'm fine. But any suggestions for games are certainly welcomed. I don't have the cap capability to record from a TV yet, so console games are out unless I can get them on an emulator. I am currently super poor also, so I will not be able to purchase games for a few months. If a lot of people seem to want me to play a particular game though, I will make it a priority when I have the income to purchase that game. I don't think this will be an issue because, in all honesty, I really don't expect to have any real significant number of viewers for a while. For those of you who are interested, I guess I'll say a little bit about myself. Uh, I'm a 23-year-old student at Michigan Tech living up here while I go to school. In case the voice didn't give it away, I'm a guy, like 75% of the people at Tech. 
I've been playing video games for about as long as I can remember, as far back as the original Nintendo system, though I believe the Super Nintendo was out, but we didn't purchase it right away. Uh, my mom was and is also a gamer, as are my brother and, to a lesser extent, my dad, so it's really something I grew up with, has a lot of nostalgia value and just, um, you know, memories and that kind of stuff. It's just very much a part of who I am. Um, although my tastes in what I've gaming and what particular games and what mediums has changed since I was younger. Um, I guess I'm a bit of a Nintendo fanboy when it comes to video games, as uh, Nintendo consoles are what we always purchased, though I didn't really have any say in the matter, so I'm not sure if I can be called a fanboy. Um, mostly nowadays, uh, my video gaming, I, I generally stick to PC games, although I do a lot of uh, tabletop stuff. I did a lot more before my group moved in off to different places, but I definitely enjoy tabletop gaming too. Um, I, I st as I said, for video games, I tend to stick to PCs because I'm rather dissatisfied with the Wii's titles, and uh, the other two consoles are both out of my price range and also have titles that don't really appeal to me that much. They don't really look that entertaining. Um, to be fair, I don't have a lot of experience with other consoles, you know, Sega, PlayStation, Xbox, because, like I said, I've had Nintendo consoles for as long as I was growing up, um, and I just, it's not that I have anything against the other consoles, I just have never really had much opportunity or anything to experience them so I don't you know I don't I don't have any hate for you know PlayStation and Xbox people but it's just not something that I've had that much opportunity to play <laughs> I'd have to say my favorite companies are probably Valve and Blizzard because I feel like they're two of the very few companies that, in general, and that's mostly for Blizzard, Valve pretty much for all their games, and Blizzard, as a general rule of thumb, still put forth some effort and make their, to make their games new, innovative, and fun instead of just coasting on brand strength or making carbon copies of other games. You know who you are. Nice job breaking it, hero. Anyway. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you'll enjoy the, the videos I post here. Uh, once again, feel free to post any sort of opinions, advice, feedback, suggestions, and what have you down in the comments below. Um, and if you like what you see, make sure you tell a friend. So until next time, this is Weezact7, signing off. Thank you for assuming the party escort submission position.